Cross missed the pinching Truba. Here comes this a two-on-one. Two Two-on-all oh, for the Russians. In, wrist shot, stop made by Gibson. Huge save on Sharkov. Wow, that's oh, a big stop there, Steve. Uh, another look at it. He comes in, got time, gets a shot off, but really good save by Gibson. Then he's able to control that rebound. Johnny Gaudreau almost had a chance there. A little, lost a breakaway a opportunity. Kucherov, and he's stopped by Gibson. Oh. That's a big save Huge right there. Huge save by John Gibson. They sense that timeout. Team Russia has really responded. And there's a the long pass. Great opportunity. Gibson stands his ground, makes the save, covers up the rebound. Good long stretch pass there by Nesterov. And uh, gets the scoring chance there for... Game two of the 2013 World Junior Hockey Championships in the books for the United States. Unfortunately, though, it's Team Russia prevailing with the victory. 2-1 was the final score. Hi, everybody. Steve Mears, EJ Raddick with you. A tough one for the Americans. They lose by one goal. But I thought the bright spot was John Gibson in net for Team USA. He gave his team an opportunity to win. Yeah, he was definitely one of the bright spots in the game. John Gibson has played well in this tournament. He was very good against Team Russia and uh, made some big saves throughout the evening that kept... His team in the game gave him a chance to win. You see him there on a semi-breakaway opportunity, made the save, controlled the rebound. Here he has a, a chance against him by to catch off, comes around the corner, tries to make a good play to the net again. Gibson is able to shut him down. And here's a nice tip chance in front, and he flashes out that right pad. So John, uh, John Gibson played well, and he's going to have to continue to play well when he faces Team Canada. He knows a lot of those shooters. Gibson, of course, plays for Kitchener in the Ontario Hockey League, and his coach at Kitchener, is the head coach for Team Canada, Steve Spot. Interesting subplot there. So John Gibson is going to have to be really good against the firepower of Team Canada. And